responses. Hi, everyone. It's Carolyn Moore from Modern Widows Club. And today we are interviewing Kathy. She was part of our Pivot six-month mentoring program last year from January to June. And I want to hear a little bit from Kathy, what the experience was like for you, since so many people here at Modern Widows Club don't know um, what it's all about, right? <laughs> so, Kathy, why don't you tell us welcome, first of all. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. And tell us a little bit about your story and how you found Modern Widows Club and then found Pivot. What was the reason why you found MWC? Well, I lost Richard in June of 2020 of what was told to me a widow maker heart attack. Okay. Um, so that was the first time I had heard this. The heard I was I was classified as a widow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I was in complete shock. It was a um, uh, within ten minutes I had talked to him, and the next ten minutes he was gone. So oh my, my whole world changed mm -hmm. in ten minutes. Um, I went into shock and trauma because, as you've mentioned before, I was the first responder. Um, so I, um, and I, I didn't have my children with me. Uh, I did have family members, thank goodness. Mm -hmm. But what I found was I went into complete trauma. Mm -hmm. Um, my world shattered. Um, <clears throat> I had an immediate loss of confidence. Mm -hmm. uh, fear stepped in right away. Uncertainty. Um, right. Uncertainty, lack of sleep, lack of eating. Um, and I had been a very confident person. I'm, um, you know, in the work world, uh, but we had been married 47 years. I'm in my late 60s, so mm -hmm. it shattered my future. And right. I really didn't know what to do. I did counseling. I did a six month mindful compassion uh, program. Mm -hmm. I read, um, I Googled one day and found Modern Widows Club. I was doing things to keep myself busy because mm -hmm. I was numb emotionally. Um, so I found Modern Widows Club and immediately joined the book club. Okay. Which, and I was, it, this was during COVID, so we were in lockdown. Um, so the, tra the uh, book club opened me up to speakers, um, to how to deal with grief on, on, and other women, a camaraderie of, of women that had gone through what I had gone through. Um, that I could, I could feel comfortable talking to and felt that, um, that I could do it in a private way that we could all grieve together. Um, from there, um, the first year I spent doing things, remodeling my home. And I finally got to the point where I said, you know, I have to do something for me because I'm not recovering. I'm not um, people were telling me, um, oh, aren't you over this yet? Or they didn't want to talk about it. They didn't want to mention my husband's name. Um, it just, I, I felt isolated, although I was in contact with a lot of people. And, um, and isolated, uh, double isolation because right, you're, right. it's during the pandemic. So. Right, right. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So the isolation was, was bad, but then again, there are, there are moments that you're, you know, you're in contact with people, but then you're back alone mm -hmm. and you start realizing that this is your life. You know how you, you have to take care of yourself. So I looked up Pivot. I had, had went online. I did the online, some of the online courses. Mm -hmm. And I thought, you know, if Pivot is like this. This is what I need. This is going to help me. And right. I, had, I had seen the pillars of a healthy woody, widowhood. And I thought, this is exactly what I need. <laughs> the, exactly. pill, the pillars yeah. we so often right. talk about because it goes back to these seven right. pillars. And we work right. every month in one of the pillars and really exactly. focus on. And the book club, yeah. the book club focused on that too. Um, right, yeah. But when I saw, I, I saw Pivot was totally in line with the pillars. Mm -hmm. on a month to month basis you know we one pillar is discussed and and reviewed and gone through in in one month um i thought i can do this and i need to do it for me i mean i'm like i say i'm, I'm in my late 60s we were married 47 years 
I don't remember a lot, much of my life without being married. Right. Who, who are you now? Who right. am I now? Um, right. This is my life. And right. I think the, did you like that? Not only were you receiving mentoring from me, right? We right. also have a guest speaker every month. Oh, I love and the guest speakers. we have the, the, the camaraderie of all, the 15, yeah. only 15 ladies in that small group yeah. mentoring too. Yeah. Yeah. You really develop a friendship mm -hmm. with your other Wisters. Yes. Um, and you, you come to um, develop friendships, even though you, you're not meeting with them. I mean, I couldn't meet with them on a, on a basis, but I, I really felt like if I needed to talk to someone, I could pick up my phone and call any of them. Right. And I hope they felt like they could do that for me. I think they um, do because in Pivot, yeah. you get to know each other so intimately. Yeah, I mean, intimately. we spend mm -hmm. six months and three mm -hmm. calls a month. And then yeah. there's the in-between communication on the private exactly. page. Yeah. So, uh, you, you know, it's such a joy for me to get to know each one of you. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, even doing the pre-assessments that I do, which we don't mm -hmm. have to talk about now, but we... Yeah. I get to know you before we even start to understand yeah. what your strengths are, what your personality is, your law story, right? right? And so there's something I think very powerful about widow mentoring. I searched 10 years myself as the mm -hmm. founder of Modern Widows Club for an extraordinary mentor. And it just didn't exist, you know, in the in the right. OOs. Um, you know, we're starting to see more of that happen. But it's this program, this pivot program is really, um, I created it so that we can look at our life now from many different directions and then pivot in the direction that is purposeful and meaningful for you. And that's where pivot ends. Right. So for you, you know, you said you didn't, your confidence was completely shattered. Mm -hmm. That's very common. Uh, right. Same here, uh, right. tremendously. Right. So what you went through pivot, you, the six months we were together and what happened at the end, what was the end result as far as simply your confidence level? Well, I, I, my confidence level was boosted, obviously. Um, I felt that I was normal. I was having brain fog and I thought this yes. is normal. I was having pain i mean physical pain um and i thought you know pivot if it didn't teach me anything else it taught me that i am normal it also taught me that it's okay to grieve it's okay to have days of grieving or moments of grieving that you're permitted to have that um so that boosted my confidence too uh there are people that don't understand they just don't get it and i'm okay you know, with that now i right. wasn't okay with it before Right. And so of all the pillars, do you remember any one particular that really like opened your eyes? Because well, I know you talked about the physical health. <laughs> yeah. One thing I liked about uh, Pivot was um, each month is done in a different format. Mm -hmm. um, you know, there was one that we did um, uh, that was artistic um, and it made me realize that I needed to bring more color into my home. Uh, and that brightened my mood and boosted my confidence. <laughs> I, I, you know, I parlayed it to, um, to my, um, you know, what I'm wearing um, um, and th things of that nature. So that helped. Um, the, um, the health one was a good one too, because we were partnered with another yes. Worcester and it really helped to focus on my goals um, and I realized I, I needed to get back into the gym. So I joined a gym, the confidence to join a gym and then to go. Uh, that, that was something that. Well, I think really it's also it. just understanding the importance and learning what you learn in Pivot is the impact it has, the mental and emotional impact it has right, exactly. on you, both physically, spiritually, relationally. Your son right. is far from you. Right. Um, you know, there's so many different factors happening for each widow in her life. And yet we are all going through these all at the same time. Right. And it's so wonderful. I, th I think that for Pivot, it brings so much hope to everyone because they 
they see that there is a way through and they see the many different ways widows are mm -hmm. actually doing it day to day mm -hmm. when we go through these pillars. And, and I've well, researched, I have not seen another program like this. No. That's why it's so valuable. <laughs> well, mean, you I, know what? I, I've done it's that. been 20 years in the making, Kathy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it, it's a wonderful program. I would advocate it to anyone, yes. uh, you know, invest in yourself. That's what I felt like I was doing. I was investing in myself. That's right. Thank you so much for sharing. I think um, it's important for people to know like really what happens inside of a program and really what happens when you leave. I mean, mm -hmm. it, it's now been, um, well, you started Pivot when you were at around six months widowed, correct? Um, well, it was 2020 and I did it last last year in 21. Okay, so it, yeah, it yeah. Was, yeah, six months. Yeah, You're right. It was six months. So now it's been, let's say, almost, um, well, I'm, I in, guess my, I'm in my third year. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, and so yeah. now looking back, can you even imagine what your life would have been without having had? Oh. Ever, yeah. oh, no, no, I wouldn't have been at the place that I am now. I I have, have made a trip. I would have never done that trip. <laughs> I've signed up for another trip. Um, um, I recently was able to have a funeral for my husband. I would have never been able to emotionally deal with that wow. uh, and be strong for my family. Yeah. Um, and just dealing on a day-to-day -day basis with, with what you have to do. I, I feel like now I have a future uh -huh. where I didn't feel like that before Pivot. I think that's everything. Uh -huh. That's really everything. And it's... I felt that too early in widowhood and I spent six years struggling to mm -hmm. figure out what that was. And mm -hmm. I, I'm, I'm so grateful we have this program because it, it does help widows mm -hmm. discover mm -hmm. that there is a future and that future looks mm -hmm. different for everyone, but each one of us is going to find great purpose and meaning. Um, and you know what? You're honoring your late husband. Yes. Mm -hmm. How wonderful is yeah. that? He would want me to move forward. He would want this for me. Um, well, I'm so, I'm, so, I'm, grateful. so great. yeah. I'm grateful for your program. I'm grateful <laughs> for you. I'm grateful for Modern Widows Club and the Wisters that I've met. I mean, it's opened my life up, really has. I'm so grateful to hear that, Kathy. And um, I hope uh, if you're considering Pivot that you will sign up. Uh, the link will be in this post. But You've heard it from Kathy herself. She went through the program um, at six months in you know her late 60s, and it made all the world the difference. And so I hope that you will consider signing up for Pivot. Uh, we have a few more spots left. And um, once the 15 seats are taken, well, then we'll we'll have to move on to July through December. <laughs> but thank you so much, Kathy, for sharing. It was thank really you. powerful. Thank you. Thank you.